Did you know nearly all non-Africans and even many Africans descend from just 1,000 people? Here's how it happened. The Khoisan of Southern Africa carry the oldest modern human DNA at 250,000 years old. 150,000 years later, a distinct West Central African genetic cluster forms. 50,000 years after that, 1,000 Africans isolate in North Africa and become ancient North Africans. Whether or not ancient North Africans and basal Eurasians were the same people or sibling branches is debated, but they likely looked identical. Then, Boom. This group explodes out of Africa through the Middle East, splitting into West Eurasians, where the only basal reconstructions available are of Western hunter-gatherers and Natufians, who later migrated back to Africa and brought this ancestry. Basal East Eurasians, however, looked like these reconstructions, although most became Neo-East Eurasians. Ones with basal phenotypes still exist in people like Ongje, Papuans, and others. This is how just 1,000 people became ancestors of the majority of the world today, spawning many different phenotypes.